Wednesday the 23rd and I haven't vlogged for ages because I've been away on holiday a holiday from hell and I'm currently taking my car to the garage Warren is following me down to take me home again my car went in for an air conditioning update before we went away and it's got loads of things wrong with it since then the air conditioning doesn't work it just blows out hot air a bit like myself the um pedal when you first start it in the morning is like a friggin a rock now i'm quite strong but it's like a rock you can start the car but it should be just a touch of a button and a light foot on the pedal but no you've got to really stamp it down um and the fans on the car are coming on even when i go on a short trip as short as going to my mother's house which is a few doors down because my knees are bad i drive down there stop the car and you swear it had been on a couple of hundred mile journey and trying to find the battery down or whatever it does because there is no engine is there um so yeah but i hope that lady is not on the desk that had an attitude problem last time because i'm not in the mood for her today let me tell you i'm not in the mood for her anyway i embarked on something new last night me and jess went along to check out something called a grow grow with kieran Obviously, I don't want to grow because I'm big enough. But that's obviously just the name of the plan. I will explain more about that in my uh, weighing update, which by this point you would have probably seen because my weighing update would be on later today, which would have been yesterday because I work a day behind. Um, now, a lot of you are going to be like, that's not round near me however he's a one man band and obviously he can only be stretched so far and he he lives in Wales um, I don't know if it's a some, you know if it's a plan that he will venture out in time and have more groups around the place or whether he's just gonna stay as a as a one man band but I'm lucky because he's in my area and I had heard about him I had heard about him even like say a year ago but I never thought to myself oh let's try it and then Jess was like let's go along so I was like all right go on then so that's what we did really nice guy really down to earth really helpful really friendly um yeah and I'll be using NutriCheck because, like I say, I'll say it all in my way and update, but it is calorie based, but it's also not. That's to confuse you, isn't it? It's the best of both worlds. You've got a personal calorie allowance, which mine is 1200 because I'm on the chubbier side. You do get different calorie allowances depending on your chub. Um, but yeah, so I've basically got 1200 calories, which I know some people only get that for the, for the day. And then I've got a big list of foods that they call power foods, which I don't have to, have to count. So on my NutriCheck, I'm not going to log anything that I don't have to count on there. I'm only going to log the things I need to count calories for. So say I make a ham salad sandwich, the only thing I need to count is the bread and the margarine or the butter or the mayonnaise I put in there, like the ham and the salad, or tomatoes, whatever I put in, the power foods will be a power food, you won't, don't need to count them. So yeah, let's embrace this um, this new thing now and 
see where we go. So Warren, no, that's not Warren. I thought Warren was up my butt, but it's not him. So I'm gonna go in, sort my car out. I would have gone in actually and seen about a new car. But I've told, oh, a bit really, I've told myself I won't buy a car from this garage again because it pissed me off so much. I'm gonna go into Cardiff and do it or pretend wherever. And I've got a fly in my car, so let's get that out. Gone. Right, guys. Oh, I should have done my hair before I got out. Look how much my hair's grown. It's like just nearly two weeks. I could really reshave that myself, but knowing me, I'll end up doing a full skin head again, so I better not. Well, for now, anyway. Right, I'm going in and I'll uh, catch up with you back in the house. I'm gonna make a breakfast with grow. So guys, I am now back in the house. This is what I'm having for my breakfast. I have got one crumpet. I've got some light spread on there. And then I've got some strawberries. So this comes from 123 calories. Now you're probably looking at that and thinking that's gonna be more than 123 calories. But on this plan, what you need to remember is the only calories I'm counting is the crumpet and the spread and the strawberries are what they call a power food and they are basically not counted. So, yeah, they're not free. They're not pointed. They're not calories. They're a power food. So, yeah, so that is 123 calories. So when I show you some of my foods now over the next week, or over the next few weeks, few months, you will need to remember the calories that I'm telling you that they are won't be for the complete dish because obviously power foods are not something you take into account. Power foods are suggested that you do weigh them so they're not completely unlimited, although they technically are unlimited. But obviously the more of them you, you, you eat, the less weight you're going to lose. So if you are hungry, you could eat a lot of them. But yeah, I've got a little portion and I've decided just to have one crumpet. So yeah, that is breakfast. Right, I am nipping out to a Tesco's. My mother wants a paper and a loaf of bread and I need some coriander. Not the fresh one, the spice coriander. And I want some chicken stock and some noodles. I am making for our dinner tonight, slow cooker chicken curry noodles. It was on TikTok on board of lunch. Now for me, this meal is just gonna be full of power foods apart from the coconut milk that goes in it. So the only calories I'm gonna to have to count for my main meal tonight is going to be coconut milk although I'm gonna pick up um, some papa doms or some naan bread to go with it so it's not quite so boring so then calories obviously can be used on them so yeah I just got to get used to what power foods are power foods and what not well, it's quite easy um, get the hang of it quite quick so yeah I can't say to you oh yeah I'm enjoying it I'm really enjoying it because I've had one one meal although I know I'm going to because it's calorie based which is what I I like there's no of this making up zillion sins for something that's only like 180 calories but you might find it's 15 sins or something crazy and you think how the hell can that be right or the burger scenario with Weight Watchers where this friggin bloody bun was something hardly any calories that for me sort of thing but it was crazy points and I'm like well how can that be I know they work it out and it's got scientific work you know calculations and all that jargon but nah calories calories you know where you are with them you know what you want to spend them on 
and then the fact that you've got these power foods so that you haven't got to weigh every single little thing because although I don't mind weighing food like every single thing it, it can be a bit of a ball egg especially when Warren's doing the same plan as me which she started today as well he's doing it with me today so there's less messing around in the kitchen you know because I've not only got to do it for me I've got to do it for him and he's got NutriCheck as well because he signed up for NutriCheck um, I think it was back in February when he was going to do calorie counting and then uh, I went up the wall because he said I was being too bossy me bossy who'd have thought um, but yeah so less weighing in the kitchen for the pair of us is obviously going to be helpful so yeah I'm saying I can't say I love it so far but I like it, yeah. I like it. So, I did buy some grapes the other day and put them in the fridge and Jackson and Dexter ate them this morning, so I might pick up some more grapes. I'll show you what I pick up when I get back. I'm not getting loads. I'm not doing a big shop because I went to Tesco last night and um, spent enough, so had to buy a remote control for our telly because the one we had broke and couldn't turn over the channel so I just picked up one of those one for all remotes and hopefully Warren will answer the door today Dexter's um, headphones broke um, Jackson snapped them he said it was an accident but he snapped them so we ordered him some of them and Jackson's computer isn't running efficiently and he's constantly getting his knickers in a twist and crying and I can't be doing with that so we have ordered him a new win Windows computer and monitor and that and it's coming today so Warren will be setting that up for him and then Dexter's got wind of him having this because I've told him it have to be to do with his birthday because you can't be shelling out hundreds of pounds just because just because he wants one um, but Dexter could do with one as well so we might get him one next month maybe trying to park here now um so yeah and the computer he can use for school because he's going up to comp because it's window it's windows i think i don't know i'll leave that bit i leave that to warren to, to sort out you know there's a pillar there don't we? Um, am I in the white lines? Because here, oh, I might move over a bit actually. They do you at this Tesco if you, um, if you aren't in your white lines, or well, I'm not that side, I'll pull out and back in. They give you a ticket, they give you a ticket if you're not in your line, which is fair enough because obviously you're taking up some space but there's nobody that can park next to me it's zigzag but I better straighten up you know let's have a look let's see who's coming it's busy here you know I think this woman's thinking, oh, I'll have her space. But I'm not pulling out. <laughs> oh. Right, I'm gonna go into Tesco now and uh, get me stuff. 
and I'll show you what I've picked up when I come out and I'll let you know uh, what it is. Right, so I'm back from Tesco's and this is what I picked up. So I'm a bit not knowing what's going on here a minute on what power foods are and what are not. So I'll stick it on screen, what I don't know, and obviously calories. Got some of these, six bottles of these. We always have this if I go to Tesco or we get the Aldi or little version of it. These you don't count calories for. I got just some Pom Bear crisps. These are 64 calories and these are 65. So I am making a slow cooker curry for dinner. So I picked up some Peshwari naans. I got two of them. You get two in a pack. Um, I won't have a whole one of them. I'll probably just have half. And these, you can have half a naan for 192 calories. These two items I picked up. Oh my God. I love flour and white. Absolutely love flour and white. Now these weren't easy on the pocket. However, they're 20 calories. Well, they're 20 and they're 19 calories for one bit. So I thought that was good. You could even eat the whole packet if you know wanted to. But if you just wanted a little quick sweet fix for 20 calories, you know. They were three pound ten a bag. But yeah, and they were with all the um like protein bars. But yeah, they are my ultimate favourites. So I picked up those. So I will be putting them out of the reach of anybody else. Um, I got some semi-skim milk. I usually buy semi-skim milk. 50 calories for 100 ml of fat. I picked up some coconut milk. That is to go in our dinner tonight. And they had a full fat version of this and the light one. And there was quite considerably a difference in the calories. So I went for the light. So 86 calories for 100 ml of that. Hold on. I got some mild chilli powder because the one we've got is, you know, it's an extra hot one. So I got some mild chilli powder. That is a power food. I got these pickled onions. They're Warren's favourite pickled onions. They something about them. They just a lot nicer. That's power food. These are power food. These are some chicken oxo. So some stock pots. These are going in our curry tonight. Yes, noodles, and they are also a power food. Um. I'll put calories on screen for them if you want to know the calories. These ice gems are delicious. They are 92 calories for one pack. I picked up some mini cheddars. They were 117 a pack. I also got some ground coriander, which is what I went out for because I didn't have any of that left. And then I picked up two packs of ham. That is a power food, so I don't have to count calories for that. And that is my, my one bag. And then I picked up another bag. Again, I've got pop doms for tonight. These are 36 calories for one. So I picked up two of them because there's there's five of us. I picked up just a loaf of bread, which I will be using shortly to make everybody a sandwich. 105 calories for one slice. So I picked up some mousses. These are 82 calories for one and the strawberry ones are 76. So I got them mainly for the kids, but I I do like them. So I might have one of those. So I've got them. I got a large packet of strawberries, and these are a power food. So I've got those. 
I picked up two Nets of Satsumas and they were Power Food. Squirty Cream. Squirty Cream is per portion, which I think is 12. Let's have a look. No, 13 grams is 29 calories because it's the light one. I've got that. I got two pints of grapes because get grapes in, they go. They are a power food as well. I then got some onions, which again are classed as a power food. Picked up some more crumpets, but these are sourdough ones and they're 99 calories for one. They had these reduced, which I picked up. I thought they'd be handy for what? For if the kids have someone around, you know, tablecloth, change the tablecloth. Or when we're outside barbecuing, can use it on our camping table. But yeah, it's just a tie dyed tablecloth and serviettes, napkins. They were reduced. That was 150 and they were a pound. So I picked them up. And then I got some Patek's medium spice paste. It says squeeze, sizzle and create 13 expertly blended spices with cumin, coriander and black pepper. And it's medium and it's vegan. That was on offer. I think it was £2. So I picked that up just for making a quick curry. That calorie wise is per 100 grams is 209 calories but the tube serves six and it serves six at 22.5 grams a portion so i got that and then the very last thing i got was some jam donuts now you think to yourself i thought she was back on her diet i am but you can eat things like jam donuts these donuts are 246 calories a donut. So we're going to have slow cooker, chicken curry noodles, and then a donut for our sweet treat after. And I will still be coming in with calories left unless I use them all on other bits and pieces. That's all I picked up. Um, yeah, that's it. So I'm going to go and make some lunch for everybody and get this shopping put away. And then I'll uh, catch up with you in a bit. So I'm just making lunch for everybody. They've had um, ham and cheese toasties. But I am making this. It comes to 272 calories because all I've had to count is um, the wrap and the cheese. I've just got it in like a tin dish. And in there I have got one egg which I've whisked up, some ham, some tomatoes, some spring onion and some spinach. And I am going to stick it in my Ninja. I've just been making toasted sandwiches in there for them. So I've taken out the middle. And I'm just going to put it on air fry. I'm going to turn the temperature down a bit. I still want it to burn. I'm going to put it on for six minutes. See what that comes out like this is the finished product in the air fryer that bit blew over and it's gone crispy but that's fine so yeah that is it and if you haven't got any of these these are marvelous for getting hot things out of the air fryer but yeah that is going to be my lunch and i shall catch up with you in a bit so guys, I have just had about six strawberries and a satsuma. Um, and I've got my friend out. Oh, Tom. I'm in a carrot. Yeah, they're nice. And he's in a blanket because otherwise he eats my, he eats my clothes. 
There he is, enjoying his carrot. Enjoying that, Tom? I'm trying to escape now. So, guys, the ice cream van has just been... And you'll be thinking, oh, she can't be having that. She started a new diet. I've worked this out on NutriCheck, and it's 281. And I will show you what I have used for the calories on it. I will stick it on screen. So guys, our dinner is ready. This is something I had off TikTok. It's um, curried chicken noodles. And it's a bit noisy in here because Dex is making a drink and the ninja's on. That is it. I'm gonna put the recipe in the um, description box if you fancy making it. But on this plan I'm doing now, my portion of this is going to be less than 86 calories because the only thing I've got to count on this is the coconut milk that went in. Everything else is a power food. So, did you hear that? Dexter just um, whispered in my ear, that smells lush. It, it does nice. smell, it does smell nice. It looks quite nice. But yeah, so that is our dinner it's nearly nine o'clock we're running late we've been doing things and uh yeah i think i've just found my christmas present as well i was looking online i'll stick a picture on screen i think that's going to be my next purchase although warren disagrees with me but yeah that is our dinner so i'll show you my portion once it's served up this is my dinner so this is 86 calories and the two of these are 72 calories so everything in there is power foods other than the coconut milk. So yeah, that is my dinner and it smells delicious. So they're not too bad either. And there's my uh, plate from the recycling shed. I haven't been out to a curry house and nicked it. So yeah, oh thanks for that. Children. Um, that was really nice that dinner. I'm boiling up. Um, they all really liked it. Dexter just said it was 10 out of 10. Mackenzie just come down and went, oh, it was banging that. I'm definitely making that again. Um, the donuts I bought earlier. Everybody's just had one bar Warren because Warren's run out of calories. Because he had a toasted sandwich at lunchtime. lunchtime. Um, which came obviously to more than my lunch, so he's actually run out of calories. Um, so he hasn't had a donut, but he said he didn't want one anyway. So I just rung my mother and said, Do you fancy a donut? And she was like, Oh, yes, please. One of the kids has just run down with that. Um, and this is mine, it's 246 calories, which leaves me with 120 calories I haven't used, so I'm not using them, I just forget about them. Um, I don't add them on to tomorrow thinking, oh, I've got an extra 120 calories I can use. I'll just go back to my 1200 calories and then all my, um, what foods are they called? I've, oh, do you know what? My mind's gone blank. What are them foods called? Pro what? The foods we're allowed to eat that you don't oh. have. That's it. See? <clears throat> my mother's, my mother's. Dementia's wearing off on me. I swear I'm getting dementia. Um, yeah, power foods. So Warren could eat power foods now if he was hungry, but he's not hungry because he's had that food. But if he was, he could have a bit of fruit or some veg or whatever. But uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have this and I'm gonna make it last. Um, and that's my day done. So grow with Kira. I've been on top form today. Um, and I am planning on being on top form and getting some of this weight shifted. How many times do I say that? But yeah, it's really good. I like it. I've been reading the book and, uh, oh, this came. I just put it down here because I've been having a look. The Ninja Speedy Budget Book few recipes in there I don't mind the look of I might give a go 
yeah i'm gonna have my donut see who would say that is a diet i have had an ice cream off the ice cream van i've had a donut and i've had three nice meals and i've still got calories to spare if i wanted them see it's all in the mind it is with me anyway it's in the mind if it's not up here you won't do it however much you want to diet you've got to have it up there working that's which you know right between 8 and 12 tomorrow i have got to be down my mother's because her boiler's being serviced so i've got the gas man to deal with i didn't hear anything back today about my car i'll possibly hear about that tomorrow and yeah bit of a boring day really tomorrow which is nice in a good way and I have no clue on what we're eating yet. I may do another slow cooker or something or other. I may. So I've got 5% mints, which is the power of food. Right. Thanks for watching, guys. And this is my first day of many. So now my holiday's over. My lovely holiday. Daily vlogs again, showing you what I'm eating. But somewhere along the line someone's going to come on and look at my videos not seen previous ones and think what the hell is she talking about um but yeah a couple of you have messaged me about um growth and i'm not sure if you're thinking of joining it online or not but um yeah it is only in wales though and it's a long way to come for some of you to come to wales once a week but yeah i'll uh see you tomorrow guys thanks for watching and thanks for your lovely comments on my weigh-in video um but yeah see you tomorrow bye guys and i'm gonna enjoy this going out i am i am <laughs>